Well, here we are down at the Falls of the Ohio State Park in southern Indiana. Actually, we're looking from Indiana to the Kentucky side. And there's Louisville over there. Railroad Bridge, the dam. And that's the fo we're on the fossil bed side of the dam. There's a nice interpretation center over here. Back up there, there's John. Hi, John. He's fishing. We haven't caught a darn thing. <laughs> Not even a bite. Had some minnows follow our bait up. But this is beautiful falls of Ohio. Ohio River. It's a little windy. Sorry, guys, if there's some wind noise. We'll just uh, put some music to this. And, uh, or just put this up. Have a little short so you guys can see where we're at this weekend. We've got a little getaway. Come on, John, catch one of them fish. There's gar and stripers in here and drum. Some big fish in here. Catfish. I think he's using a rooster tail right now. It's beautiful down here though. Early morning. Buzzards are flying over here though. Look at that. Hello, buzzards. There's a bunch of them. There gotta be a dozen of them or more there. Flying around, circling. This is all the fossil beds here. You can see the driftwood up there on the bank. There's little pockets of water here and there. We came from down that way. We already started down there and fished. Seen some kayakers out here this morning fishing with their fishing kayaks. And I think there's one boat over here too. Let me see. Uh, there's a fishing fisherman over there, kayakers. There's two of them. There's one in a big angling kayak and one in just a really little kayak over there. Those waterfalls, that's a dam wall that you have to keep water flowing through here. I think all, those little slits go all the way down back over there. John says there's a cave on the other side here, but the only way to get there is to go across the dam when it's closed, like now, and go all the way across there and then walk all the way down and cross all those little, cre little creeks that run through on those fossil beds over there on that side. Someday, when my knee is not so bummed, I'll get over there. Oh, now the buzzards are over here by the railroad bridge. Crazy birds. We saw a huge train that had a locomotive in the middle of the train. It kept going and going for like 15 minutes. But this is September on the fossil beds. August and September, I think, is when the water is lowest where you could get down here and actually walk around and explore the fossils on the fossil beds. There's some right here. I'm looking right here. See it? They're all ancient sea creatures, corals and little tiny little sea creatures that are mineralized. Look at all of those. There's some shells, there's horn corals and fan corals. Lots and lots of them. This is the most I think I've seen. The bigger fossils are seem to be down here where the water is usually at. This is the lowest that I've ever visited. The water level's lowest that I've ever seen down here. I'm sure it gets lower, but I've never seen it. And John's still trying to catch something. I think you'd get a nibble on that thing, but nothing. We've tried a couple different baits, a couple different lures, and not a bite. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Twelve buzzards is what I counted. A dozen of them. Looking to scavenge something for dinner, for breakfast. 
<laughs> or lunch. Well, you guys all have a nice day. It's five minutes at the fossil beds. See you later.